Good morning. This is Jeanette Marshall with uh, you this uh, this fine day. Um, just wanted to do a quick check in because I haven't uh, I haven't done the video blog for about a week, and I realized that you have to be consistent with this in order for traction to happen and to uh, gain viewers. So as I go through and try to launch a video blogging portion of my social media personality, Optioner JM, I'm applying some of those principles that I know to the video blogging part of things. So if you're just starting out in social media, there's a couple things that you should know. That um, people say uh, they want to go viral or they want to go um, and have hundreds of thousands of viewers overnight. Well, I've been doing this for five years. There's my buddy dog, my dog buddy. Um, there is very few times that you're going to just exponentially uh, skydive into the Twitter sphere or social media just simply by being there. Uh, people you know you see there there's all kinds of ways that you would uh, buy buy uh, followers and viewers and that myself I could never get that really I could never understand why people would pay to do that uh, anytime uh, you do things organically slowly steadily it has a longer far-reaching effect just like dieting if you diet and you just go on a crash diet and you starve your body then what happens is is when you when you go off of that um, what will happen is you'll just gain the weight right away so it's the same thing if you think that you can just um, buy viewers buy followers and what have you um, I know that there's some some venues out there where you can um, you know purchase just about anything that you want and uh, and that includes clicks and what have you um, depending on what your your goal is um, you know slow steady as the race and um, and there is no race because you are building your audience you're building your following and it's going to be based on predictably what you are interested in what what you're saying and how people whether or not they're learning anything or they like looking at you or uh, they think you you have some kind of a knowledge base so and there's some catchy and funny and and all kinds of different things so so don't think of anything as going to be magical and overnight and when they say viral that happens probably I'm just gonna guess and I could insert the stats later but I'm gonna guess that um, you know one in about five million uh, tweets or what have you is going to have any kind of attraction of any kind of registration and registration might be uh, trending on hashtags and Google and what have you. I did do a thing that was kind of fun on my uh, blog the other day was I uh, on Halloween just did to see what was trending on Google and uh, not surprisingly, interestingly, uh, Heidi Klum apparently has this big Halloween party every year and it looks like she, um, people are fascinated by knowing what her, her Halloween costume is going to be. Again, we all know the name Heidi Klum. Do you think this notoriety on her Halloween costume happened overnight? I would say not. In her sphere of influence perhaps, but not to the general pop population. Did it go viral? I don't think so. Was it popular and was it trending? Absolutely. So just take that um, take that advice. Whether you're a brand or a person, it's not gonna ha it's not gonna happen overnight. Um, there's gonna be times when you're you're gonna think, "Geez, why am I wasting my time?" And if you're a brand, you're gonna be thinking, "Why am I wasting my money?" Uh, you're wasting it if you're not if you're not here and you're not at least trying and trying different experiments like I am with viral because at the end of the day it should be a learning journey why are you here uh, if it's to gain notoriety and popularity then my suggestion is is you have to do it offline first um, and notoriety ask 
ask Justin Bieber <laughs> doesn't always uh, last forever and uh, sometimes it can end up being the demise of people um, because they're constantly under the focus. So remember what you tweet, what you share, what you post uh, can be uh, retrieved and found with you. So just be conscious of who and what you want to be identified by and with. That's my quick note for today. This is Jeanette Marshall as Optioner JM. I hope you have a great week. Take care. Bye-bye.